All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Fruit Basket Season 2, Episode 22. I can't believe we're already 22 episodes, 22 episodes into this now, man. We've done... I just... It's flown by, I don't know. It's 22 episodes into the uh, Season 2 now. It's wild. Time's just flashed by. But um, anyway, no more rambling from me. Let's get into the episode right now. She was just a weird classmate who lived in a tent. Oh. Well, that's a good job that you did. Oh, that has so much more meaning now. Oh, just when I thought the show couldn't get him anymore. After his friends' memories were erased when she was when he was younger. And he couldn't do anything about it. Oh. Oh, well like a minute into the episode and I'm already dying. Oh, amazing. But um on the topic anyway, last episode we had a lot of Yuki's sad backstory from his past. All from, all the way from Akito being a twat to Kyo not liking him because of the position he was in, and all Yuki wanted to do was be friends of him. All the way to his mother being a horrible mother, and his brother doing what he did back then. And then the episode ended off with Yuki and Toru meeting for the first time. And so much was revealed there and how a lot of things came to be. How the hat was Kyo's and then Yuki passed it on to Toru. My god, this was destiny. They were always meant to meet. So amazing. So amazing. Is this going to top last episode? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> this was quite a surprise as well. Hearing Yuki say that Toru is like a mum. Does that kind of push to the side any idea of Yuki and Toru being, you know, together? I don't know. That was interesting to find out. Oh. Tyra would make such an amazing mother. Yeah. Oh, no. Mm. Well, because she is. God, he looks so shocked. Then being someone I was romantically attracted to, she felt more like, oh, okay. All right. Oh.
Oh, damn. Getting some insight to how Yuki views her relationship with Toru. <laughs> That's true. Ah. Oh, hearing him say that. He does. I don't know. She looks at you the same way sometimes too, Yuki. Oh. You won't be. He doesn't know when to go up. He's really greedy. Oh. I'm glad he is so desperate. <laughs> oh. But you felt that one. <laughs> I love these two. Oh. <laughs> Dead. Rest in peace. Ignored. <laughs> I love I love Kakaru so much. Yeah. That does help. I think he's kind too. He's a dumbass, but I think he's kind. <laughs> yeah I understand Toru can be something someone that you can open up to but sometimes there's some things even you couldn't tell her which is why it's nice that he has someone like Kakaru in his life Yeah, yeah, it is, yeah. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Just chill out in the kitchen, both of them. <laughs> Cinderella. I know, right? <laughs> 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 
<laughs> oh, that is the last person. <laughs> that is the last person you'd want in the audience at your play. Oh. <laughs> oh, is she sure better be there? He better be there. That'd be like having your dad there, but a dad that actually loves you, unlike his real dad. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. Why did he just bring that up? Why is Kyo so annoyed by that? It's like... I love when Toru looks lost. <laughs> so cute. I wonder what the meaning behind him telling him that was. I'm not big brain enough to understand. I think I'll get it soon. <clears throat> oh my god, this is just... Oh, I can't wait to see him there too. Costume changes. He's only playing the fairy, god uh, fairy godmother, so he only has, what, two costumes? I can't wait to see him as the fairy godmother, that's hilarious. Look at her, she's struggling. <laughs> Bro, they should switch characters. Someone shut her up. <laughs> Spit out blood. <laughs> uh, maybe. I no, I can never imagine Terry being proper angry at someone. <laughs> it looks like the stage from my high school as well. Oh, with memories. Oh my god, <laughs> that dude. Jesus Christ. Jesus. I'm A. <laughs> Look. 
look at the look at the rest of the class. You'll get arrested. Yeah. <laughs> 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 no, not for Cinderella. <laughs> mm. I love the comedy, the comedic aspects of the show. Oh my god. Um wouldn't it just be easy to recast? Kyung Gyun. I want to see him act too. To laugh my head off. Exactly. Exactly. Sorry. Uh, yes, you are. You're the main character. You got to do it. Okay. Everybody has their own problems. I wish Kyo knew half of Yuki's life too.
he's so nice to everybody. Like he remembers everybody's names and their classes and what they're doing in their class and too. Oh. Oh. What did she mean by that? No. What's this feeling I get from Yuki all of a sudden? <laughs> hmm. What did he just do? Did he say something? Oh. <laughs> she won't. I can't say for certain the others won't. <laughs> Oh, growth. What a really nice episode. It was nice to see what we saw from Yuki. And we got to see what we saw from the play as well. And Yuki's confrontation with Kyo was needed. Kyo kind of saw something in Yuki there, I think. Like, maybe he was wrong about something. And then we saw Yuki's... Yuki talking with the girl from the other class and Machi. And I think something struck with Yuki when Machi said he was nothing like a prince. I think... I think he kind of liked that someone saw him like that. I don't know. Maybe there's more in depth, uh, more to come for, like, in depth going into the his and her character. That'd be something, something interesting to see, I suppose. And then at the end of Kyo realizing how hard Toru's trying and her wanting to be there for Kyo, Kyo, you know, giving in and hopefully growing some more as a person for the people around him that care about him. Which is good. He needs to understand there are people that care about him, don't want to see him fail and want to see him succeed. So, you know actually tries to look past this curse and see something in his life to look forward to. And that more than just him being caged up for the rest of his life. Ah, <sighs> But yeah, really nice episode. I'm really looking forward to the, the last few episodes. And yeah. Anyway guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day. Um, peace out.